another thing you were telling me earlier was that you would much prefer to have a shark encounter while you're spearfishing versus if somebody were surfing. If you're a diver, you can defend yourself uh, from a shark a lot better than a surfer or a swimmer. A surfer or a swimmer are sitting ducks. That's why I don't want to go swimming in New Smyrna because <laughs> yeah. I, I feel like I've been, you know, I, I, all my defenses are gone. Right. right. But Even if you don't have a spear gun, though, and you're diving, you think you have a better chance? Yeah, if you're diving, yeah, because you can always hit the shark with your hands. You can charge him. If you go right. out at a shark, swim towards him, you'll frighten him. Really? Yeah, because he thinks you're going to hurt him. So if you swim away from him, he's going to attack you. He thinks you're prey trying to get away. So uh, the worst thing you can do from a shark is run like crazy away from him. Then you're going to instigate an attack. Can you pull up that video? Type in uh, Mick Fanning. This is what I was telling you about. The guy Mick Fanning was in the surf, surf contest in Jeffrey's Bay, South Africa. And he was sitting out there waiting for a wave by himself. And all of a sudden, you just see him get pulled under. And yeah, watch this. He's a sitting duck. And you can see the fin come up. I think it was the, one of the uh, pectoral fins come up. Watch them. It grabs his leash, like the leash that connects his foot. There he is right there. Yeah, that, see, he's totally helpless right there. If he was a mask and fins and a stick in his hand, he would have been able to fight that shark. Now watch, he starts hauling ass swimming as fast as he can. Yeah, that, that normally, if it was like a Caribbean reef shark or a bull shark or something Look like that, that, that would get him attacked. The great white may not, but yeah, uh, apparently uh, one of those, of a bull them, shark or a Caribbean would have, would, have, would have come back at him really? and nailed him. Oh, yeah. What kind of shark was that? It was a great that was white. a great white. Great white, yeah. The bull has, they say, three times the jaw pressure in his bite of a great white. Really? Yeah. It's a very bad bite. What would you have oh. done in that situation if you were him? I, I wouldn't have. I'm you not would have never been in that you situation. You wouldn't have swam away. Yeah, for one you, would, minute, you wouldn't you, be in the situation. You don't have much visibility there. Yeah, I wouldn't have been surfing. Right. Now, I was going to tell you something before I forget. If you're... If I'm luring in sharks for feeding and, and scraping meat and drawing, creating a shark feeding frenzy, I'm probably safer doing that than if I am just randomly spearfishing. Because, okay, you spear group in a hole where your head's under the rock and your feet are hanging out trying to get the group out of the hole, you're 100% vulnerable. If there's a bull shark in the area, he's going to attack, that's when he's going to get you. So as a shark, di if I'm shark diving... I want the sharks to be there when I'm right, spear fishing. You're expecting them coming. You're aware of them. Yeah, no, you're right. aware of them, and you're in de you can defend yourself because you're, you're, that's all you're, you're looking out for them. That's you're expecting it. it. When you're spear fishing, I don't want to see sharks. Yeah, right. I don't, you're not I'm, not, I'm not uh, aware because when you're focusing to get a fish at that moment, that's the when the sharks come up. Shark likes a bite when he, you're not looking at him, mm. like all predators. Okay. They, these animals, they're looking for a meal. Now, what makes animals dangerous? Is how hungry they are. Sometimes <laughs> yeah. sharks are not hungry; they're not going to bother you. Yeah. You know, the hungrier the animal, what motivate, uh, motivates a, a lion or a tiger or an alligator, or crocodile, or shark to eat somebody is how hungry is that animal? How desperate? You know, when you when you're really really hungry, you're ready to eat anything. Yeah. I don't like that food. I you know I'd rather have a steak, but I'll eat that rotten hamburger because I'm really hungry. So you there's no exceptions. When a shark is really hungry, he'll make a meal of what's there. People seen him trying to eat a log in the ocean. They're so hungry. Wow. So That's have you been cool. in a situation where you're having a shark charge at you and you char you charge back at it? Yeah, it's all yeah. my life. Yeah. <laughs> and, so, life. And, and so what, they just get they get scared of you charging back at them? Or yeah, what you do you do? You just run face to face to them? We do it all the time. We run them off or they steal your fish. <laughs> yeah. You know, you run them off or, or they'll bite you. Don't run from them. Because you can leave the area, but you, you got to watch your back. Remember, he wants a bite when you... You can defend yourself when you see it coming. Same thing with an alligator. Yeah. You can levitate a charging alligator. But if you, the one that bit me, it was an ambush. I never saw him. Right. I was too lazy to look behind me. But if I would have seen him coming, I've had alligators go after me. And at the last minute, I get low in the water and I grab him by the shin. I tilt the head up and that disrupts her attack. It confuses the alligator. And you usually do that a couple of times, it'll warp the attack. I had one try to take me down 10 times before. I mean, I could have left the water and then it'll stop. But every, right. as long as I was there, he kept coming around. He tried going underwater at, at me on the surface, different styles of attack. And really? I was able to block him every single time <sighs> on the attack by uh, grabbing. You got to make sure you don't put your hand in his mouth when he's coming at you at the last minute. 
You got to grab that skin down there. I mean, don't go try this on your own. I won't. Yeah. I'm not going unless I'm you're there. Yeah, you do not. this, if all of a sudden your boat broke down and you're swimming and you got attacked in the last resort, it's good right. to know something like that. Yeah, definitely. But don't, I'm not telling you to go look for these opportunities, I'm not. you know. <laughs> it's kind of like, you know, I, I took karate lessons. I'm going to go to a bar and pick a fight. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah. No. Somebody will beat your butt or you might get shot in the head. Right. <laughs> right. Exactly. <laughs> something like that.